Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tutorials. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you what's essentially like Emmet is for HTML and CSS, JavaScript snippets is to JavaScript. It's a quick and easy way to add a ton of JavaScript really quickly. So if you're one of those people that writes a lot of JavaScript, uh, like myself here, you'll find yourself rewriting a lot of things a lot. And you can type something like, uh, make sure I'm not in, you can type something like council log, right? You can type a council log a hundred times. So there's a really great package for Adam that makes this really super easy uh, to just sort of reuse snippets of JavaScript. Now, if you've used something like Emmet for HTML and CSS, then this is going to feel right at home, but only for JavaScript. We have a package called JavaScript hyphen snippets. Now JavaScript snippets is a really, really nice package here. You can see it only has 35,000 installs, so not a ton, but a good amount. And what you can see from here is that it's going to function. Now that we have these package installed, let's go ahead and restart Atom. Now you don't need to restart Atom for every package to work, but some you certainly do. So now we can just come into our JavaScript file and let's try out some of these snippets. For instance, you might be writing something like get element by ID. So we could just type GI and now you can see we have get element by ID already written for us. Now that's just too easy. Now here's some cool ones. We wanna write a loop. You've probably written a hundred loops. We could type in FE for for each. And now that's going to give us a for each method for an array here, okay? Now in addition, if we wanted to do a for in, we could do for i, and you can see for prop in object. And you can see that it's basically a for loop, a for loop for us generated without having to do a whole lot. In addition, we can have a function with fn, you can see here, or we could even do something like a set timeout with st. As you can see, it's very just common JavaScript patterns and syntax made easy for you with some very predictable uh, keyboard shortcuts. I mean, what would you expect council log to be? We could just do cl, and here we have council log. There's also something like cw for council warn. We can have something like us for use strict. So basically what I would suggest to you is if you have an idea of what a two letter shortcut could be for a specific JavaScript feature, just try it out. And if it works, then awesome. And if it doesn't, then maybe check the documentation in the package to see if there is in fact a shortcut for that. Either way, this package is just too helpful to not recommend. So JavaScript hyphen snippets all the way. It's gonna help you write faster JavaScript. As always, this is Scott with Level Up Tutorials. If you have any questions or comments, leave a comment in this video, or hit me up at Twitter or Facebook at Level Up Tutorials. If you like this video series and would like to help support, you can subscribe to be a Level Up Pro and have access to download these files, or you can purchase these files as a digital download at store.leveluptutorials.com. As always, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.